a contractor agrees to lay a road 3,000 meters long in 30 days. 50 men are employed and they work for 8 hours per day. After 20 working days, he finds that only 1,200 meters of the road is completed. How many more men does he need to employ in order to finish the project on time? if each man now works 10 hours a day. The total number of hours worked on the road after 20 working days equals to the number of days multiplied by the number of men multiplied by the number of hours. The number of days is 20, the number of men is 50, and the number of hours is 8. Multiply these numbers and the total number of hours after 20 working days is 8,000 hours. The length of the road is directly proportional to the number of hours. Since 1200 meter of road is laid in 8,000 hours, how long will it take to lay 1 meter of road? To find this, we are going to divide 8000 by 1200. Now how long will it take to complete the remaining length of the road? To find this, first we need to know what's the remaining length of the road. So the total length of the road was 3000, 1200 meter is already completed, so the remaining length of the road is 1800 meters. To find the number of hours needed to complete 1800 meters of the road, we are going to multiply 1800 by this number. 1800 meter of road is laid in 8000 by 1200 multiplied by 1800, which equals to 12,000 hours. So the required number of hours are 12,000. Let the number of men to employ be x. To find x, we are going to use the same equation. Number of days multiplied by number of men multiplied by number of hours, which will be equal to the total number of hours required to complete the project. Number of remaining days is 30 minus 20. Number of total men equals to 50 plus x and the number of hours each man will work is 10. 30 minus 20 equals to 10. 10 times 10 equals to 100. Now we need to isolate x here to find its value. First, get rid of this 100 by dividing it on both sides. Fifty plus x equals to one hundred and twenty. Now subtract fifty from both sides, and we get x equals to one hundred and twenty minus fifty. So x equals to seventy. Therefore, seventy more men need to be employed.